Hong Kong's high-speed railway has just gone into service, and it is supposed to significantly reduce travel time. So we are putting it to the test against other modes of transport. Five SMP reporters are going to make the journey first, starting from our headquarters in Causeway Bay in Hong Kong. The finish line is in Tai Kung Kui, a shopping centre in Guangzhou. Let me introduce you to my colleagues. Danny Lee will travel by plane. Jing Zhang will take the direct coach. Michelle Wong will take a coach to Shenzhen and then switch to a taxi. Kenneth Long will travel on the through train from Hong Kong's Hong Kong station to Guangzhou East Station. And Nok Song will take Hong Kong's MTR to the Shenzhen border and switch to a train from Shenzhen to Guangzhou. We'll see who will get to Guangzhou the fastest. Are you ready? Yes! Go! The Airport Express is just arriving and it will leave in about four minutes time. We are now waiting the Cross Harbour bus. We have been here for about five minutes, but we still have no buses. I am now at the bus stop in one time. So actually we have about 45 minutes to wait here. So I've just left the cafe lounge, had a quick pit stop, uh, some food and some drink. Typically Hong Kong. Oops. We just got on the coach to Shenzhen Bay. They were having some technical issues and then we waited in the line for 15 minutes and now we finally got on. Car A should be there. So here we go, we're finally, finally setting off. Hello, Josiah, good morning. Thank you. Yeah. We're going on the bus now, and it says it takes three and a half hours to go to Guangzhou. Let's hope there's not traffic jam. spent around 15 minutes to cross the border. Now we're going to take a taxi to Guangzhou Tai Kou Bay. So we just bought a ticket from Shenzhen to Guangzhou and let's get on that train and see what happens. We don't go to Guangzhou. We spent around 25 minutes to find a taxi. So now we're using the DD app to call taxi and it's like 450 yen. Thank you. Thank you. It's a fairly brisk jog over to the immigration desk. Yeah, we are just late for five minutes, so technically we are still very on time. It's been around three hours since we left the office. We finally found ourselves in Guangzhou. We are going to be there in ten minutes. You're the first one to arrive. Thank you. Yeah. So how are you feeling? I'm tired. Yes! You're a loser. Look, you're a loser. Guys! <laughs> so thank you guys for uh, finishing the first part. And then the next part will be the high speed rail surfaces. And we'll see how we will be compared with what we have done today. So I'm now back in the SNP office in Hong Kong, and it's the first day of operations for the new high-speed rail service to Guangzhou. I'm going to leave now to see how long it takes me to get to Tai Kou Kui.
So three hours and 28 minutes. It looks like the new high-speed railway train does get people here faster than the other options. Thank you for joining us. See you soon.